hello my lovely subscribers welcome back to my youtube channel as you can see on the screen we're going to make chicken wings so as you can see this is my chicken i'm going to wash it thoroughly remove all the fat excess fat and the uh, excess um hair on it so i try to showcase how i wash my chicken so it's just two videos in one to make it easier so i'll just keep on washing it and then try to take all the fat as you can see yes so with warm water yeah today i i didn't use my how do you call it my clothes yeah because i really want to feel how uh, what i'm doing anyway so as you can see there this is how i do wash my chicken so this is what i'm taking off as you can see the fat and the hairs as well so i'll do this and then wash it after and then use my vinegar and then use and lemon juice as well so first of all we'll use the lemon how do you call it the vinegar and then wash it again so i really like how the vinegar give that texture it takes a lot of uh, fat on the skin yeah so you, you leave it with this nice texture yeah showcasing that is very clean as well so sometimes i just need to i like the texture to the sense i just want to leave it like that but then the overpowering of vinegar wouldn't allow me to do that so i will just go in with my lemon juice as you can see and do same and then wash off the uh the vinegar smell out a bit so yeah i still like the the, the texture so after using the lemon so as you can see you can see how <laughs> it looks clean yeah so now that is done washing but part is done now so we'll go ahead and do the main thing which is yeah so you can see me washing my sink several times i hate using meat sometimes touching is a problem but then we just need to do what we have to do so you see me washing my sink quite a lot of time just to wash off the smell of the meat as we know so that's not part of it but then today i decided not to uh, edit my video i'm just give it leaving it on the speed how they call it so this is my meat so now after that i'm just using my garlic ginger and scotch bonnets yeah and onions and then blend them together and then use it as my how do you call it my seasoning so yeah i use water and then blend it off so the bell paper you, 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 you saw it i'm just using it later you see what I'll, i will do with it so don't skip this video because you might skip a very vital part of it so whilst using that i i pour some of the blended garlic ginger and squash bonnets and then i just added in my chicken seasoning and dill so i will just go in with my black soy just to give it color you can use your um how do you call it not me uh, how do you call it kali kali to to it to just kali uh, we Ghanaians call it that way so is <laughs> curry <laughs> anyway it's just just fun of that of it so i'm not editing that just for you just to, to laugh a bit so i just squeeze it in now that it's done don't mind me yes this is it so i will just go ahead and cover it with a plain bag and set it inside my fridge for 30 minutes just for the for it to marinate through my uh, you know sometimes when you crack on your bone you just feel like yeah this is really marinated so after 30 minutes i'm going ahead and then dip it in inside my cornstarch you can use any uh, plain flour or anything you have at hand at that particular time so i was i wasn't having uh, i didn't have how they call it my plain flour so i'm using my cornstarch and they give it that crispy uh texture to it so i'll just go ahead and dip in my oil to fry so i try using that too it didn't work for me so i'll just have to 
drop it and then use my hands because that will make it faster and easier so while that is done please if you uh this is the first time you can come across this channel please don't hesitate to click the red button below please subscribe it's free of charge yeah if you already have um a youtube channel like even if you don't use it you don't need to fill in anything but if it's the first time it will ask you a little bit of your details just for you not for me anyway so in that sense it shows that you was you subscribe you've opened a youtube channel anytime you decide to put something is you don't need to go and do that again so it's free of charge as i mean so i flip over and then let the other uh parts fry and then as you can see yeah it's done so i'll just take it off and then do my second batch so it's been a while i know please forgive me and my subscribers oh my god i can't just my returning subscribers thank you very much yeah i can't thank you all enough you've been so amazing and i love you so much i cannot even express it thank you so much for uh for sticking with me even though i know i'm not consistent but you're still here with me supporting me any other way so thank you very much for that i really do appreciate and i'll try my best to, to bring you uh, new recipes at least once a week hopefully this does the aim but if i'm unable to do that please forgive me and please support keep supporting share the channel to your friends and family let them come to join the big family of a dealer's kitchen yes so as you can see i'm taking off the chicken and then do this nest badge yes so yeah i have three uh types of doing my chicken wings i have one i i i how do you call it uh oh <laughs> messed that anyway so i have one i put in the oven and then the one i just did here yeah and yeah i'll try to bring you the rest of it um inshallah so yeah i just took that off and then we'll proceed so yeah uh, me being a shrine you know <laughs> i just do want to like to do things overboard which sometimes is good sometimes it's bad anyway <laughs> so i will uh, um, you know, I, I like to leave my chicken wings like that. Some people like to cut it into two, which sometimes I feel is too tiny for me because chicken wings doesn't have even mean enough meat. So cutting it into two it just make it worse <laughs> to my my own opinion. Some people like it that like that. So with this uh with the full chicken wing, you just taking three of it will be enough for you yes so i'll repeat the same thing i did earlier and then uh yeah so flipping that again over and then let the other side fry it as well yeah so as i was saying thank you so much please do check out my instagram page for dealer's kitchen and on there you'll find my two other um instagram pages one is for cosmetics another is for selling products but like yeah fabrics shoes and bags jewelries yeah do check it out and the cosmetics is just um i will launch it on the 25th of march please stay tuned i'm bringing organic products so nobody's left out dark skin hot chocolate caramel skin whites and extra white and then we're here for you and then uh as time goes on if you keep buying my products i'll come and show you how i do it so that you can do it in your own in the comfort of your home without buying any chemical product outside so that you know what's going into your um skin products yeah so please support as you always do uk people is the easy way to push but we push world where we try our best and serve anybody everybody so 
with me being a try just uh marinated it again with my bell pepper and onion at this point when your chicken is not well how do you call it seasoning this the bit you can just add it so my season was okay but i just decided to add some black pepper a lot of it even <laughs> you cannot have a, a lot of black pepper powder in it in your chicken wing so as that is uh, done i just place in my how do you call it um fries in the oven i decided to oven uh to to bake it rather than frying because i would like to just reduce the intake of oil but still we can do it so the little we can we just try to do it. So this is how it looks. Look how appetizing it looks. So still waiting for my fries to be done. So I lowered it to for it to not to to become too cold because I hate uh cold chicken wings or warmed chicken wings. No, I don't like it. So it is it. Yeah, we just me being this right. You can just leave it after frying and then that is it so this is how it looks and this is how i it. thank you very much if you watch this video to the end god bless you please stay tuned for more videos and see you in my next video bye